levels to this. I'm going to try this out, see if this um works out for me. It actually saves memory on my computer and everything. So I'll literally go live on Twitch. I can make my videos the same way I usually make them. And I don't have to worry about memory on my computer or anything like that. And I can just grab them and export them over to freaking YouTube. <clears throat> but the cool thing is that if I do my videos this way and you guys want to stop by like literally in the middle of my video and start chiming in you follow me on twitch put your notification on and then as i'm making my videos boom it'll pop up i'll be able to see you all right so a few things i want to talk about today well actually one major thing i want to talk about today finally it looks like the xbox series x is actually showing its power Maybe I shouldn't say finally. Maybe it's it's always. No. See, I don't know exactly how I feel about it. Because this is a big deal and they've been doing it. But I kind of want more. I want to see the power within the new games. But at this point, this can't be denied. You can't deny this. And what I'm talking about is 97 games right now have the fps boost fps boost enhancement on the xbox series uh x and some do on the xbox series s now that's a really big deal and that that is regardless of what you think that is a show of power that is a show of power there's a lot of graphics cards out there that can't do this regardless of whether or not you have to reduce the resolution so some games i'm, I'm gonna show you guys i'm gonna go to the actual website some games they have to reduce the resolutions to actually get to that 120 and then other games they don't but it's impressive let's go take a look at this list real quick let me go ahead and switch over to screen okay and then i'm gonna show you guys what this looks like yeah i think i'm gonna like this because if people hop on they'll be able to freaking They'll be able to to chime in and everything. I think that'll be dope. We'll see. And if nobody hops on, then it just just becomes just a regular YouTube video, which is straight too. <laughs> I really I ain't tripping. Hey, what's up, Just Too Grim? Hey, I'm actually making uh. Oh, so we actually got somebody. So check this out, bro. So I'm actually making a YouTube video right now. So I'm gonna start making. We'll see how it works. I'm gonna start making some of my videos this way. And I'll post them up on, on YouTube, and then people will know that whenever I go live on Twitch, I'm actually making a YouTube video. So instead of leaving a comment, if you want, you could just comment right now, you know, and I'll be able to read it, and we could talk about it, have that discussion. So this video is going to be about the, um, the power that the Xbox Series X is actually showing. What up, what up, what up, Ruth? You need to change the name, Roof. Yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. This is, there's levels to this. You already know. But check this out, bro. Tell me what you think. 97 games have FPS boost as of right now on the Xbox Series X. Now, to me, that's a huge show of power. It is because I, I have a PC and I have a lot of friends that have PC. I'm lying. I don't have a lot of friends. I have a few friends that have PC. I'm lying. I got two friends. I got two friends that got PCs, right? And I know that to hit 120 frames FPS, you need a beefy graphics card. A beefy graphics card. It's not every game. It's not every graphics card that's doing this. So for Microsoft to be able to get that FPS boost on these games and be able to run it, it's actually unlocking that power of the Xbox Series X. Which to me, this is this is what I wanted when I bought the Xbox Series X. I thought that's what it was gonna do i didn't i didn't realize that fps boost was a thing i understand that the hardware inside my xbox series x is stronger than my 1660 ti laptop that i got i understand that it is the problem is i didn't understand why it was capped does that make sense so why why is it capped but let's, let me go to this list i want to show everybody what we got okay Man, the chat on my phone doesn't doesn't update as fast. All right, so this is what we got right now. This is from Major Major Nelson, I think it's called. Yeah, Major Nelson, right? So oh, let me refresh my chat just in case you 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 hit me up, Roof, because I don't wanna I don't wanna miss anything you're saying. I'm 
over here tripping like yo is roof hitting me up on oh, no, the roof is quiet all right so check this out the 60 frames i'm being honest with you the 60 frames yeah it's it's a must it's a must so it says anthem 60 frames so you're telling me that anthem was running at 30 before if anthem was actually running at 30 frames on the ps4 and the xbox one that is horrible assassin's creed 3 remaster 60 hertz that's fire that is fire assassin's creed games are dope assassin's creed uh, rogue fire so let's look at what games these this really matters for the whole collection the whole Ezio collection at 60 frames i'm telling you the game is going to feel different the game is going to feel different you guys are going to enjoy it if you actually play it at those frames battlefield one at 120 hertz any first person shoot 120 frames yo that's that's I'm t that's showing the power that's showing the power like i don't understand i don't know how this stuff works so i don't know why they can't do it with every single game but the fact that they're actually doing it with all these games is huge this is an incentive for anyone out there to go ahead and get a monitor or a tv that could do 120 hertz and there's a huge misconception people think that a, a tv that does 120 hertz is extremely expensive if you're trying to get a 4k 120 yeah that's going to be a lot of money 4k 120 that's going to be a lot of money but you can get tvs like the tv that i got wasn't that expensive and it does 1080p does 1080p 120 and I'll tell you this much, 1080p 120, most of these games are probably going to be running at 1080p 120. I think the only game right now that runs at 4K 120 is like the Master Chief Collection, which is amazing that they did that. But check this out. Let's see what, let's see what Roof said. That's definitely showing the power of the Series X. It is. It is. It's definitely showing the power of the Series X, which is freaking amazing. All right, let's keep going. Dirt 4, a racing game at 120. And I promise you, once you experience 120, you're you're probably not gonna go back. You're not because for for to be honest with you, 4K is not really 4K over 1080p, depending on how close you sit to the to the TV, is not really worth it. Shout out to um Optimus Optimus Code. He made a good video speaking about that. Okay, nobody. Far, look at that. Far Cry, uh, Fallout 4, Fallout 76, Far Cry 4, Far Cry 4. Any of these shooter games. So they were, wait, were they running at, at 30 before on the old consoles? Because that is horrible. Any first person shooter running at 30 is, that's horrible. I don't care how great it looks. Gears 4, that must have been running though, like that. Because when I played Gears 4, it felt like it was running at 60. This is a total list. This is not the new list. This is a total list. The Lego games, that should be easy to do. That shouldn't be that hard. But then again, I I don't know. Oh, hold on. I just missed a big one. Metro Redux. I haven't played this game myself, but I heard th th these games look amazing. I heard they look freaking amazing. And for you to be able to play this game at... 120 hertz bro that's huge what else we got start from the top metro last light redux 120 mirrors edge catalyst 120 i heard that's fire let's see what grim says honestly it's an impressive feat for the series s to be running at 120 no you're right you're right but some of the if you if you're seeing the screen right now roof some of the some of these stuff is not available so you see how like mirrors edge catalyst 120 hertz but then on the series uh s is not even available uh, again I, I'm, I'm not i'm not sure what's going on but then you got moto gp20 that's not available on the series x but it is on series s that makes no sense to me why would a game not be able to be boosted on the x and it could be boosted on the s i don't know maybe i'm reading this wrong now for um supposedly the check mark means that um when it says off by default the check mark hey what's up jet five hey i'm we're just we're just talking about how um there's 97 games that have fps boost and i was telling uh i was telling just to grim or or roof i was telling him how i'm gonna start see if it works i'm made my youtube videos this way you know just record them on here or live stream them on here and when people talk i interact with you guys and then i'll post them on youtube and if somebody wants to comment on one of my videos while 
I'm actually making it live to so just turn on the notifications on Twitch and we'll see if that works. This little idea popped up. It wasn't my original idea. I saw from somebody else I was doing something similar. I was like, oh, that might work. Let's see what's up. Uh, <laughs> Jed Fox said, thanks for posting the link in the description on TK9 video. Yo, my bad. Yeah, I'll be, I'll be, I'll be I'll... you know what? That dude needs a lot more followers too, man. TK9, he's, he's to me, he's very entertaining. I, I'd be dying laughing his, watching his stuff. Um, he came at me hard though. He came at me hard though, but I came at him back. What up, right, Grim? I came at him back. Did you see that stuff, Grim? That's probably the longest reply video I've ever made, but that's because that's my dude, K9, so I had to do that for him. Um, let's see what else we got. Hold on, let's keep going. Plant versus, versus the zombies. That's the isn't that a first person shooter game, right? Power Rangers Battle for the Grid. Is that a fighting game? Hey, yo, Grim, you watch you, you uh, this, isn't that your stuff? Grim, uh, isn't that spy um don't you play that? Don't you play um Power Rangers fighting game? Is isn't that a fighting game? A fighting game at 120 hertz? That's fire. That's fire. I'm telling you, man. This is this is what I wanted from Microsoft. This is what I wanted from the Xbox Series X. But I but to be honest with you, I, I want them all. I want every single every single game on Game Pass I want to run at at least 60. I know they can. There's no way that they can't. My oh my cam's in the way, my bad. Oh, you can't see the thing. My put my cam up here. Let's see if that works. Good looks, good looks. You see, this is why we do this. This is why we do this live. We'll go back. All right. My bad. Thank you for that. My bad. So, is that better? Is the camera placement better? So, Power Rangers, right? Battle for the Grid, 120 hertz. Fire, if that's a fighting game. Okay, Grim say he don't play it though, but it's still a fighting game, so that's got to be fire, right? Super Lucky Tale at 120 hertz, eh? I'm sure at 60, that's fine. That's fine. Skyrim, Skyrim at 60, fire. I'm telling you, top, the Division at 60, very nice. Tomb Raider, very nice. What we got, Quilindo. They say that the developers must agree first to have some of their uh, plans to release patches. You see, okay, so this is, so then maybe this is going to work. Maybe this is the way I'm going to do my video. So I can have you guys chime in and stuff and, and let me know what's up. Because, okay, so the developers are controlling it. So the developers are putting a cap on the FPS boost. Because I'm sure it could probably do this to all the games, right? Could you imagine? Bro? <laughs> Why why is Grand Theft Auto not running at 60 frames? What's up, Sinister? It says, what's up, Doc? This type of video is much better. You get vibe with the subs live. Yeah, yeah, for real, for real, for real. Um, and like I said, I know I'm probably gonna say like three times like, again. I'm gonna grab this video, put it on YouTube once I'm done, and then um I'll let people know, like, hey, when I'm making my videos live from now on, I'm gonna try it out, see how it works. If you wanna come in and chat with me while I while I'm making my video and rebuttal the stuff that I'm saying while I'm making it, that's all day. Um, but yeah, let's see. Uh, Grim said, "Big facts: the Series S running at 120 is big. It, it is, it is. I don't know what what resolution is running at, but you know what? The people that bought the Series S, hopefully by now, if you bought the Series S, you know what you bought it for, and you're okay with it. Like my dude, Iso Motion Gaming, like he bought a Series S. He's got a really powerful PC. That's his. I would call that his casual his casual gaming system." Like, literally, he plays, he actually plays a lot on it, though, but he mostly plays, you know, casual games, I would, I, I'm going to guess. He already mentioned when Resident Evil comes out, he's getting it on, on the PC, because he's got a really powerful PC, so he wants it the best possible. He's not getting it on the PS5, he's got a PS5, he's going to get it on the PC, okay? Um, Kalindo said it. Okilindo said, and some of the other games cannot be included because of the way they were developed. The plant boost makes them unstable. Oh, but here's the thing. Here's the only thing to that, though, Quilindo. If it's a game that's also out on PC, I'm going to call BS. I'm going to call BS. I'm going to call BS because if it's a game that was also developed on PC, all they got to do is grab the same PC game 
and port it to the Xbox and have it run that way. I don't know how, but that that's in my mentality. That's how that would work. I don't I, I don't know exactly how. Uh, Grim said I have both the Series X and S. Okay, Colindo, the little S is a monster. I I wouldn't call it a monster. I, I wouldn't call Series S a monster. Let's see what happens when these first party games come out and and Microsoft can actually use um all their tools bro i hate i hate tools guys i i hate when the sony ponies makes fun make fun of us for talking about tools because it's true like why why are we talking about tools we should have had these tools it's crazy like if i if i look at my xbox series x box it literally says velocity velocity architecture like on the box but it doesn't say velocity architecture will be implemented after eight months of release that's not what it says guys that's not what it says um but let's take this out. Ooh, Watch Dogs 1 and 2 running at 60 hertz. Mm, okay, that's fire. Now, check this out. Check this out. No cap. I played Watch Dogs 1 and 2 on Stadia. And I'm pretty sure it was already running at 60. I'm just saying. Pretty sure it was already running at 60. Okay. Uh, let's see. Jet Five says um, they said they waited for RDNA two. Yeah, yeah, but I don't. But nobody told me they were gonna wait for RDNA two. They didn't tell us they were gonna wait for RDNA two. At least I, I didn't. I didn't see that anywhere. That's what I'm saying. But right now, with the, with these 97 games, like they're they're showing that they have this power. They're showing that they have this power, and I I don't care what anybody says. This cannot be downplayed. This is huge. This is huge. Playing games at 60 frames. Once you start playing games at 60 frames, you cannot play a game at 30. Good luck. Good luck. Especially like a shooter game. Like your input will actually be worse. I promise you, if you play a game, a shooting game at 30 frames, and then you bump it up to 60, you'll feel like you got better. It, it is because it's a lot smoother. The controls, everything, the, 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 the way the game moves, everything looks. And then playing at 120, <sighs> And get yourself a monitor with a with a with a fast response time. Oh, it's a wrap. It's a wrap. Let's keep going. Let's see. Uh, Sinister says uh, tools should have been out day one. Exactly. Exactly. But in my same videos, guys, you guys see the comment section. You'll see people talking about what they say. They say, um, "Relax, Doc. The system just came out." Yo, they got all my whole five hundred dollars. What do you mean the system just came out? I don't, I, I, I don't, I don't understand it. Hey, what's up, Harold? These consoles came out early. That's why tools haven't came out. 